Hey there. So today is a little bit of a dreary day. Sun's not out, not too pretty, just kind of feeling down. So what better way to feel better than to play in a little makeup? That always makes me shine. So I'm going to go over a tip I learned yesterday about concealer. Uh, if any of you got these dark circles, some of it for me is hereditary, some of it's iron, and some of it sometimes I don't sleep too well. So we're trying to cover up them dark circles. So I'm going to go over with my, I got a concealer brush, I got my concealer. On your concealer you go one to two shades lighter than your foundation. And you go in a V circle, you go it down in a V is what I was doing, but now she told me to pat it and go down like this, all around your cheek. And to pat that in. And this is before you apply your foundation. Because if you do your if you do your concealer right on that dark circle, that brightens that one spot and that's really gonna pop that that dark circle out. So you don't want to just brighten where your circle is. And that's where I was messing up because I was lightening that up and it showed up more. You don't want to rub it, you just want to pat it. And I'm looking at my mirror, I'm sorry. But you just want to pat it in. You don't rub on it. Okay, so now we're going to put the foundation over that and we're going to see how well it works. I'm only doing half my face right now so I can show you on my video. Okay, so we're going to blend it in. Oh, my hair is getting in the way. I didn't put it up today. Oh, wow. What a difference. Look at there. See how it's a little bit shadowed right there? So you just get your concealer after your foundation if it's like that, because mine's really bad, and go over it again. And you just want to pat it in. I'm going to get right there too. I'm even swole right there. Old age is creeping in. <laughs> All right. So now I'm just gonna blend it in. Wow, look at that. Amazing. <laughs> Yes, look at there. Yeah, no more dark circles. I'm so happy. Try it out today.